Hey, what's up, you guys? Welcome back to another video. Your boy just got out of the gym, so you know, I'm feeling pretty good, you know? I decided to come home and shoot this video for you guys. But to my subscribers, the last thing you guys saw me get from my apartment was my couch, which is right there, all right? Y'all saw the delivery for that, all right? But for the people who are new to my channel, a couple months ago, I ended up getting an apartment. I didn't have any furniture whatsoever, you know what I'm saying? I had to start from scratch. So, you know, I ended up getting a couch, but I also, uh, you know, for an apartment, you need a bed, all right? So I ended up getting me a bed, right? This whole entire bed setup was under $300. I got it all from Amazon, all right? So I caught a sale on the number one best-selling mattress on Amazon, got that for 140. Then I came back and I got the Amazon Choice uh, Modern Bed Frame. I got that for 140. So all together under $300, for a queen size bed. This is queen size, all right? This is queen. I felt like king would be too big after I did the little Amazon feature where you could see it in your room. I felt like the king was too big, but I actually could have gotten the king. I didn't realize how much room would be, you know what I'm saying, left over, but I'm not tripping. To me, queen is perfect size. So, you know what I'm saying, I'm perfectly fine with that. Right now, I'm about to show you guys, you know what I'm saying, the little small features that I ended up getting in the meantime, and then we're gonna go and get into the bed, all right? So you guys know my setup is supposed to be retro modern, as you can see from like the type of lamp, sofa, you know what I'm saying, my table. I always wanted, I wanted to keep that retro modern look, all right? So uh, you guys haven't seen these yet. These are my bar stools that I ended up getting from the flea market for $50 for the entire set. $50, it's the little air lift. It has the little switch under there, if I can find it. All right, it has the little switch where it can go up and down both sides and then when you sit on it it actually got a little give to it i don't know if you can see it but look at the it's leather oh my god dude th this is a steal the same exact type of bar stools that i was looking at online for this set was like 130 dollars. so i looked up with that and i got this uh this little canvas right here i got that for two dollars at the flea market i just felt like you know when you step back and like as soon as you walk through the front door it just fits it just fits man but now I'm finna get into the bed. Now this bed is queen size. Again, I have just have to repeat that. So the prices will be different. And plus the mattress is no longer on sale. It's back up to regular price. I think it's back up to $179.99. It is an eight inch mattress, all right? So uh, I will be dropping the links to the bed and the mattress in the description below. So if you're interested in that, you need, you know what I'm saying? School's about to start back. So, you know, if you need a real cheap bed, that's very good. Hey, look. Click that link and, you know what I'm saying, get you a good old little setup. I mean, it's still going to be relatively $300 anyways, but I mean, you know what I'm saying, I did save $30 on that mattress. You know what I'm saying? We all about saving money. You're trying to get the best budget. This is the best budget bed setup out there. I've been to so many furniture stores, all of that, all right? And trust me, this is the best route to go if you're trying to save some money, all right? And uh, this bed does have bed risers on it. I will show you that. So whenever you get the bed, it is not gonna be sitting this high, all right? All right, so here's the bed. Again, it does have risers on it. These risers are five and a quarter inches. So whenever you first get it, I'm 6'2". It came to my knee. But now, as you can see, it's a little bit past my knee. All right, it's about, you know what I'm saying, lower thigh. So, you know what I'm saying, that's way better than what it was. It was honestly like below my knee at first. But this is a 14 inch modern platform bed, all right? It's gonna be all metal, easy, the easiest bed assembly probably in the world. I'm not gonna lie to you. It comes with its own little sock wrench, everything. Like it is super easy. It only took me and Emily 30 minutes to put this thing together, all right? You get a person with you, Super, I'm telling you, it's, it's going to fly by, all right? It's super easy. And at the bottom, I would raise up the mattress, but I don't want to. Uh, it has like a non-slip. It has like non-slip adhesive. So you pull off the paper and your mattress won't be moving side to side and stuff. It, it keeps it together, all right? Uh, the mattress is eight inches. It's a linen spa mattress, all right? And like, look at that just gives to you. It's very, very comfortable. I'm not going to lie. It's very, very comfortable. But this is the bed setup. Again, this, when I got it, was 140 And the mattress was on sale. It was 144 So under $300, you can get you a modern bed setup. I feel like this honestly fits 
exactly what I wanted in a bed. Now, the other bed that I wanted, it was modern, but it was very futuristic type modern. All right. Uh, it was it was way out of there. It would have been way lower. And I don't even think you would have been able to rise it. So I was going to have to get, you know, spend extra money on box springs and all that kind of stuff. And, you know, that, that would have been extra. All right. So with this bed, again, it's 14 inch platform. You slap some risers on there if you're, you know, I'm saying a taller person and boom, this is what you get. Now, for people who are interested in, you know, the uh, the comforter set that I have, still actually got the bag right there. That's wild. But uh, it is made by Cotton, full queen size, uh, three piece set, garment washed. All right, that's the uh, and it comes with a little thing so you can like feel in the store and you can see exactly how it would look. And there we go. And of course, you know what I'm saying, got some. Got some sheets from Walmart, man. Don't be spending $60, $70 on some sheets. Go to Walmart. They are telling you these are some wonderful sheets. These are some very, very soft, good quality sheets. I'm not going to lie. So go to Walmart, get you some sheets. Uh, if you guys are wondering what kind of pillows I got, I actually went to Ross and got some Tommy Hilfiger uh, pillows. They were jumbo size. I got them for, uh, if you can see it right there, the Tommy Hilfiger logos or whatever. But they were $15 uh, per set. They come in twin packs. So, you know, for $30, boom, you got four pillows. So that's what pillowcases look like. I give you a little up close, a up close span of what everything looks like. Decided to go with the gray sheets because it would bring out, of course, the gray in this. But, you know, there we go. I feel like this is honestly the best budget bed. I mean, honestly, this is better than the bed I had back at home before I moved up here. Just to be real with you. And it was way cheaper. And the bed I had at home was way smaller. And it was way more than this, all right? So under $300, you could get this. And also, the delivery was super fast. I honestly got both of these in in a week, all right? But there's always that but. When you do get this delivered... If you stay on the second floor, you know, whoever delivers your stuff is, they're not gonna hate you, but you know what I'm saying? They're probably gonna be sweating, all right? I recommend if you uh, get this delivered, get this delivered to your home, all right? And try to get it inside. Both of these boxes were taller than the doorway. They were very, very, very heavy. Now, when I got these, I got them delivered to Emily's place because I didn't want to leave a mattress and a bed frame sitting outside my door while I was at work. All right. I work from 1030 to seven. So I don't even get home until like 715, 720. I didn't want to leave my stuff out there that long. So I got to deliver it there. So if you do get this bed delivered somewhere else, get somebody to help you. This is some heavy stuff. This is the, both of these boxes are super heavy and more than likely they probably will be taller than you. All right. These boxes both were like seven feet tall. All right. So that's just a warning. It's some heavy stuff, but it's well worth it once you get it inside and stuff. It didn't take that much time to put the bed together again. It was like 30, 45 minutes. It comes with uh, a blueprint that's super simple. Everything is labeled. You literally put pieces together, put the screws in, tighten it, boom. The bed is set up and it's very, very sturdy. All right, it's, it ain't going nowhere. It's real thick. Uh, it's good quality. You know what I'm saying? To be spending $140 on a bed frame, it's real, real good quality. It is all metal. All right. So, you know, if you know, if you want some wood, this won't be this won't be for you. But both of these do come in different uh sizes. Like the mattress, you get like the eight inch, twelve inch, you know what I'm saying? It got different thicknesses. And then with the bed, you could get the 14 inch. And I think it I think you can go higher. Uh I'm not exactly sure. Um uh, but they do come in, of course, uh, full size, twin size, and then you got a uh, king size. And I think you can actually get a California king uh, bed frame and California king mattress. And that's a good thing, too, if you just want to get something that's just super huge. Also, I forgot this is another good way to kind of, you know, what I'm saying have some storage and not have stuff just cluttered up in like one spot, like in your closet, for instance. I forgot to show you guys that. So I'm going to show you that this being a 14 inch platform bed. With risers, I have ample space under the bed to store stuff. That is my bow fishing bow. Ignore that. But, uh, you know, you can fit a lot of stuff in there. So you can get like under the bed little baskets or whatever, and you just slide them under there. Perfectly fine. That'll just save room, you know, out of your closet. My closet isn't the biggest, but it's not the smallest at the same time. Uh, ignore those clothes right there. I, I haven't gotten a dresser yet. So, uh, you know, I just have to 
get them out of the way. So I throw them right there and I don't have enough hangers for all of that stuff. But, um, you know, I could take all of this stuff, put it in those under the bed baskets. I could slide it under there super easy. All right. So that's another good thing about this bed. All right. Again, it has risers. So I have a little bit, you know, I have roughly, you know, 20, I have about 20 inches of, you know what I'm saying, height space from the bottom of the bed to the floor. So, you know, that's, that's a lot of space. And on the end, I'm thinking about, you know what I'm saying, putting uh what they call them, like ottomans or something, or like a trunk. I might put that right there. But again, ignore that stuff on the right too. It's way more room than I was expecting. So, you know, I actually could have gotten a king size and I still would have plenty of room right there. But, you know, again, that's the whole entire bed set up. But that's it for today's video. Thank you guys for tuning in. I hope you guys enjoy. Again, the links to the bed frame and the mattress will be down in the description below. Uh, I see you guys in the next video. I'm out.